Hey everybody, it's Amanda, and I'm here to do um, a very long overdue uh, uh, unboxing. Excuse me. Um, I su stopped subscribing to NerdBlock, and I started uh, with Geek Fuel. Um, Geek Fuel is very similar to NerdBlock or Loot Crate. Um, you get like a geeky, nerdy stuff. Sorry, I had a little brain fart there. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah. So you, it's seventeen dollars and ninety cents a month plus shipping, and you get a T-shirt in every box, and a whole bunch of other geeky type goodies. So I've never received one of these boxes before, so I'm very excited. This is, I believe, January's box. Like I said, I know it's very overdue. I haven't done videos in a couple months, so I apologize for that. Anybody who's a fan and has been looking for my boxes, I apologize. So let's open it up and see what we got. So right up on top, looks like this, and it says bonus, retro video game magazine, special issue number zero, and it looks like it's got a um, uh, price of $9.99 or $10.99 in Canada, and it looks just like that. Retro gets pint size, best of the year, best of year one on the verge of greatness, how one man's passion project became the ultimate love letter to 8-bit action gaming. Let's see what it says later on. Let's open up the geekiness. Alright. So since I'm lame and didn't open this up last month, the first thing I see here is the flash contest. Um, uh, grand prize is all that lovely stuff there, and it's got code or whatever, but since it was last month, it is done and over with. My bad. Oops. And it looks like you get a Geek Fuel magazine, very similar to Loot Crate or Nerd Block. It looks like that, and it looks like this theme, month's theme, well, I don't really don't know what this month's theme is, it doesn't... I wonder if there's a cart. Oh, yep, yeah, there is. Brief history of time travel. Metro Warp. It's kind of cool. But let's see. So it does look like it. It kind of shows a little bit what's in the box. Tells you a little bit more about Flash. Um, just normal geeky. Type stuff. T-shirt. We'll look at that later. And what's this? Looks like Zelda. Orange Sword Sours. Candies. Good thing I opened that, otherwise I'd get nasty and gross. But I really don't eat a whole lot of candy, um, so I will give this to some kids. I don't know. I have nephews, and I work with a, a guy who's got a young son, so we'll see what's in this box. I think one of the reasons why I got this box was because it had Resident Evil stuff in it, and I am a huge Resident Evil fan, not to mention a Marvel fan, so we shall see. Oh, that is kick-ass. It is the Umbrella Core pen, uh, pen, or pin. Holy cow. Oh, I'm super excited. I'm so going to put that on my jacket. I can't wait. Let's see what it says. Um, have you given your blood to help Umbrella Corporation further their interest in bioweapons? No. Of course you have, because they wouldn't have allowed you to escape without doing so. Um, okay. <laughs> anyway, that's pretty cool. I can't wait to put that on my jacket. And it's in a nice nifty jewelry box. Here, I thought they were sending a jewel here. Well, I guess in a way they kind of did. My jacket wears it, not my neck or my ears. Although I suppose you probably could wear it in your ears. I wouldn't suggest it, but you probably could. And this is a Jakku Comic Con Intergalactic. The event of the millennium. That's got to be a video game or movie of some sort. Kind of cool. I'm not really sure what it is, but 
Forget San Diego, the Jakku Comic Con is the best place in the entire galaxy to catch your favorite stars, travel out of this world, and see people, places, and things you've never expected. And this one's kind of heavy. I'm curious what that is. Ooh, it's a coffee cup. Star Labs coffee. <laughs> it's like Starbucks, but not Starbucks. If any of this offends any of you and you guys are Starbucks uh, coffee fans, I'm sorry, but their coffee is rank. It is nasty. Um, I wanted to say something else, but I was going to keep it clean. So anyway, um, yeah, so that's really cool. Thank you, Geek Fuel. So far, I'm very impressed with this box. And what are you? Metro Warp. Geekfuel.com, a $10 value. It is obviously some sort of a game that you can... Uh, there's a code in there, and see it says $10 value. Um, not sure exactly what this is, but maybe my husband might be interested in it. I don't know. We'll see. Last but not least, let's put some of this stuff back in here. Let's look at our t-shirt. A brief history of time travel. <laughs> That's kind of cool. So you've got... I don't know what that thing is. Um, so I can get it closer. Then you've got the TARDIS, the DeLorean, Another TARDIS, a Terminator maybe, and the Hot Tub Time Machine. <laughs> that cracks me up. This is a pretty cool t-shirt. Um, and it gives the dates. 1895, 1963, 1985, 1989, 1991, and a zero, zero. I don't know. You be the judge. Ooh. Maybe. <laughs> Sorry. There you go. So anyhow, that is this box. I'm very impressed with it. I'm glad I decided to subscribe to it. Can't wait till I get this month's box, which is currently on its way to me, which is why I'm kind of doing this unboxing because I'm lame and I apologize again. So. If you liked the video, please like, comment, or subscribe, and give me a thumbs up. Talk to you later. Thanks. Bye.